What's going on everybody? We are in the middle of a heat wave. Most of Texas is in some kind of heat warning. We've had temperatures in excess of over 100, heat indices of over 125, so it's crazy. It's dangerous. So we figured out what better way to stay cool than to get in the water, do some wade fishing this morning. So the only lure that we're using today, the only one that we got tied on, is this new skinny lipper by Saul Strong. It's kind of in between a top water and a twitch bait. Has a little lip right there. We just have a small window where that water starts heating up, temperatures start rising. That's the only thing that we got tied on today. That's the only thing that we're gonna use. We're gonna see if it catches fish, see how good it is, see if it works. In the shoreline it's a mix of grass and sand and some mud um, just probably about thigh deep i'm gonna work that lure to see if we can get anything oh there we go there we go first fish of the morning first fish of the morning on the skinny lipper all right that's <laughs> a tiny guy There you go, see you go. On the skinny lipper. First fish, it works. Let's see if we can get some bigger guys. Already got on our first fish, so we'll just kind of keep that pattern, see if we can get something going, see if we can get something bigger. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, there was a trout right there, right in front of us, went after that lure. Jesus. All right. Alright, so there's a ton of mullet in this area over here. Um, you can hear them kind of moving out off the shoreline, just going into deeper water. So we're going to end up working that. Right now we're in about thigh deep water. Ended up getting on one trout, small trout, a little dinker. But uh, we're just going to keep working and see if we can get any more. Oh, there we go. There we go, got one. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water. It is a little guy. Oh, <laughs> chill. Ow! <laughs> it's a little guy. Doesn't have a whole lot of spots either. Just a few on his back. Thank you. All right, so this area is looking a little juicy. Feeling a little confident. We got birds working over here. We got a whole bunch of mud along the shoreline. They're kind of moving off as that sun's coming up, but we got all the conditions. Perfect for speckled trout, redfish, so. And so far it's been a decent lure. I just don't know if it's just the conditions. You can see it has this little lip on it. it has the single inline hooks. I think these are one knots and then has these little lines on here just to kind of mimic a, an injured bait fish or maybe some blood on there it floats i mean you it's just fish it like a jerk bait it'll sink down maybe about six eight inches down the water float back up you can just keep it down there you can do give it a steady retrieve twitch 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 or just jerk it on the top just kind of like an injured bait fish so it casts pretty decent i mean sometimes it does flip around and you get it spinning you don't get a great cast on it but you can get it just right kind of just starts through the air shoots through um, you can get a decent cast on it doesn't weigh a whole lot there's no rattles in here just well, at least i don't think there is oh yeah there is <laughs> it's been working we've been catching some fish not as many as we wanted it's been kind of slow to be honest but we're going to keep this tied on <laughs> hopefully we can get on some more fish we're just slowly working it just twitch 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 and reeling in the slack at the same time I mean, you can actually just reel it in give it a steady retrieve and it kind of has a wobble to it i don't think y'all can see it but i'm seeing a lot of slicks but they're just offshore they're kind of in the middle of the bay I'm not seeing too much here along the shoreline aside from just the mullet and the birds working but not really getting any fish i'm not sure if it's just the lure or it's just a bad day plus the weather conditions just make it horrible horrible but you never know you never know it could turn around yeah i can see a whole lot more mullet right here and then of course you got the birds over here so we're kind of getting into that that hot zone i guess so i'd be very surprised if we didn't catch a fish right now i 
Uh, someone after it right here. Hmm. Oh, there's something big right here. Something big chasing the mullet. See if we can get close enough. Oh, oh there we go. There we go. Oh, shit. What is it? Oh, did he spit the hook? No. <laughs> he spit the hook. Son of a... Wow. Oh, that was something big because he was chasing... Those mullet just came out and you saw a huge wake. Then he started taking off to the left. I bet you those are big redfish. <laughs> ah, that's a better cast. There we go. Oh, he got off again. What are those? Huh. Oh, my rod does not feel good. There we go. You know what? <laughs> I think those, I don't know, those might be skipjacks. They're just messing with me. There we go. What are you? Now we'll find out what it is. That one's hooked. What are you? Oh no, that's a trout. That's a little. A decent guy, not a keeper, not a keeper. There we go, skinny lipper, little trout. Thank you, sir. Oh, there we go. There we go. Come on. Right where I thought it'd be. Not a big guy. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Oh, my <laughs> God, don't. God bless. I'm going to have to clean that when I get home. Get all the water out. Not good. Oh, solid, too. Got a little, got a little meat on him. Oh, thank you, sir. I mean, this lure's working. I just think it's honestly a slow day. You know, I think if we threw anything else, we'd probably still have the same result. So, not knocking the lure. Yeah, I just uh, saw a whole bunch of wakes over here. I mean, I don't think it was that little trout. It just kept getting hit after hit after hit. Let's keep making some casts in there. See, see if we can get anything else. They have to still be in there, whatever they were. I'm feeling a little. There we go. <laughs> oh, what are you? What are you? Going to the right. Another trout. Another little trout. I jacked up his eye. Sorry, dude. There you go. Well, maybe they were trout, but I mean, those wakes are too big. Unless they were just mullet. Coming up to the top, getting spooked. Right, I think we found a little school of something. A little school of trout. Or... I mean, there's no doubt in my mind that that skinny lipper catches fish. but <laughs> We just need some quality fish. See if we can find out where that school went. Oh, and I got a wind knot. I'm going to have to fix that later. Now yeah, that knot's messing me up. It's not letting me cast far. Oh! I get hit. Just sitting there. Oh, 
kinds of crap going on with this grill. What the hell's going on? Right when we get onto some fish. <sighs> right when we get onto some fish, we start having real, real problems. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that was my only lure. That freaking knot did me dirty. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> took way over there that's the only one i had that's the only one i ordered stupid me um well we'll just keep an eye on it i guess and just wait for it to float back to shore if it floats back to shore god bless grab this in piece of crap There's my leader line. All right, let's uh, cut this guy. Don't have a leader line, so we'll see how that's gonna work out. Hopefully we don't get cut off. That'd be the worst, because it's the only lure I have. All right, <laughs> we're good. Let's see if we can get onto some fish. Why does it sound like shit? Ugh. I don't understand. <sighs> After all that, it's wrapped around the guide. <laughs> oh man, it's all process again. Now we can fish. There we go. Perfect. Everything's good. Let's just hope that fish are still biting. Yeah, we don't have a leader line like I mentioned, so if we do get onto some fish, then good chance we may get cut off. Oh, there we go. First cast after retying. Perfect. Little guy. Little guy. But the good thing about this, they're not biting it close to the leader or close to the line, so. Little guy. Thank you, sir. First gas after retrying, so yeah, they're still here. Oh, there we go. Oh, that one feels better. That one feels better. Oh, oh yeah. Ooh. I don't know if it's big or not, but it just feels better than the other one. All right, what are you? There goes that knot to my Oh, yeah. That's a trout. Thank you. Oh. Let's get the grippies. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Right in the corner of the mouth. There we go, guy. Okay. Yeah, so we had that school come by, and I lost them they kind of stopped moving stopped chasing bait it's to the left didn't see much so i ended up casting out to the right and i guess that's where they ended up going that's probably about a keeper trout it's about a 17 inch trout i guess thank you there it goes Ah, oh, just got tagged right there. Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, it came off. Son of a... Maybe a little dinker. But they're hitting it. They're hitting that skinny lipper. Definitely gonna have to buy some more. Definitely gonna have to buy some more. Oh, there we go. There we go. Feels a little bit better. There we go. Has to be a trout. I feel that head shake. Come on. Come on. Going to the left. Going to the left. You trout. 
<laughs> Come on. What are you guys? Oh yeah, that's a trout. That is a decent trout too. There we go. Decent trout right there. Get this hook off. Check him out. That's probably about an 18 inch trout. Perfect. Yeah, I was going to give it a few more casts and head back. I ended up getting this guy. Perfect. Thank you, sir. All right, so I think that's going to do it. That wind's kicking up. That sun's coming out. And actually, I got to head to work in just a little bit. So now the question was, can this lure catch fish? <laughs> Absolutely. We ended up getting on some, some nice fish. A whole bunch of dinks. Uh, but we still caught fish. This lure works. I only have one of these. Uh, and so I'm <laughs> definitely going to buy some more. Keep those in the tackle box. The other question was, can we catch fish in the middle of a heat wave? But uh, yeah, yeah, we can. Not the ones that we wanted, but that water is a lot warmer uh, near the shore. I can see a lot of those trout sticks popping up in the deeper water. As you can see them like slowly coming to shore, you can smell them. So they're feeding offshore. They're feeding in that deeper water where it's a lot cooler, which makes a lot of sense. But we're still catching fish. Thank you all for sticking around. If you like videos like this, please make sure you subscribe. Please make sure you like, comment, and uh, watch this next video right here.